Welcome to the Mathematics of my channel and thanks for watching. In this video, we are going to find the sum of uh, this nice infinite series including hyperbolic cotangent. So, n is equal 1 to infinity hyperbolic cotangent of phi n over n cube. Okay, how to begin? Well, first, uh, I'm going to take another infinite series n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n square plus x square so we know this is equal to pi over 2 times x times e to the pi x plus e to the minus pi x over e to the pi x minus e to the minus pi x minus 1 over 2 times x square in a previous video uh, i uh, solved this infinite series and uh, we got as answer uh, 5 over 2x and uh, this part minus 1 over 2x square so if you like to watch that video i will add the link in the description and also make a card so we know now uh, this is equal to pi over 2 times x and this part we know equal to hyperbolic cotangent of pi x minus 1 over 2 times x square okay then uh, I'm going to isolate this part so we can write pi over 2 times x hyperbolic cotangent of pi x is equal to 1 over 2 times x square plus sum of 1 to infinity 1 over n square plus x square okay then uh, let us uh, isolate cotangent hyperbolic cotangent of pi x we know now we should multiply by 2x and uh, divide by pi so here we have 1 over pi x plus 2x over pi times n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n square plus x square okay then uh, in our question we have hyperbolic cotangent of pi n so uh, i am going to take instead of x i am going to take n and uh, here we have n so we should change it so n is equal k so we can write hyperbolic cotangent of pi n is equal to 1 over pi n plus here 2n over pi infinite sum now instead of n k so k is equal 1 to infinity 1 over k square plus n square well uh, then here we have some of, uh, hyperbolic cotangent of phi n over n cube therefore i am going to take infinite sum both sides n is equal 1 to infinity hyperbolic cotangent of phi n over n cube is equal to so this side we can write n is equal 1 to infinity now here we divided by n cube so uh, here also we should divide it by n cube so here we have 1 over pi times n to the fourth plus here we have 2 n over pi we should divide by 1 over n cube so 1 over n cube and here sum of k is equal 1 to infinity 1 over k square plus n square okay then um, let us uh, simplify a little bit so here we can write now pi is a constant so 1 over pi n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n to the fourth uh, plus then here again uh, sigma notation uh, here before it here we have 2 over pi is a constant and here we have n is equal 1 to infinity k is equal 1 to infinity 
1 over uh, here n get cancelled and here we will have n square so n square times k square plus n square okay now uh, here we have uh, nice uh, double sum so let's evaluate this double sum so uh, we can uh, write here our double sum n is equal 1 to infinity k is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n square times k square plus n square so i am going to take our sum is equal to s and here we you know this is also equal to s so we can write this is also equal to n is equal 1 to infinity k is equal 1 to infinity now uh, here we can simplify 1 over n square times k square minus 1 over k square times k square plus n square okay uh, here now we can simplify uh, we can write this is also equal to n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n square sum of n is sorry here k k is equal 1 to infinity 1 over k square minus now here we have n is equal 1 to infinity k is equal 1 to infinity 1 over k square k square plus n square okay then we know this is also equal to s this is also equal to s so 2 times s is equal to now here we know this is equal to uh, theta of 2 so and here also this is equal to theta of 2 so we can write theta square of 2 so we know s is equal to 1 half theta of 2 we know 5 square over um, 5 square over 6 so pi to the fourth power over 36 so also we can write this is equal to 5 to the fourth power over 72 okay then uh, we can write now our sum n is equal 1 to infinity hyperbolic cotangent of phi n over n cube is equal to we know here we have 1 over phi here also 1 over phi so 1 over phi is a constant uh, factor so we can take outside of the uh, sigma notation outside of the parenthesis so here we have n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n to the fourth power we know this is equal to theta of 4 so we can write here theta of 4 here plus 2 times 2 times s s we know 5 to the fourth power over 72 okay then um, we can write this is also equal to 1 over pi theta of 4 theta of 4 we know 5 to the fourth over 90 plus here 5 to the fourth over 36 because these two get cancelled and we know pi also get cancelled and common denominator we know uh, 180 so here 2 uh, here 5 times so 7 times pi cube okay this is the answer if you like this type of videos please subscribe this channel thank you for watching